Hello everyone, welcome to Excel 10 tutorial. In this advanced Excel tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can calculate your mortgage payment. Okay, actually how you can calculate your monthly mortgage payment. So let's get started. In this tutorial, I'm going to use PMT function and before get started, there are a few things you should know. First one is rate, which is interest rate. And if you are calculating monthly mortgage payment, you will have to consider your interest rate. And if it's not monthly, if it's annually, you will have to divide it by 12 to get the monthly mortgage value. Okay. Then the second point is NPER, which is a required argument. And it means the total number of payments for the loan. Okay. And the next one is PV, which is also required arguments and its present value or the total amount that a series of future payment is owed right now, also known as the principal. And the next one is FV, future value, which is optional argument, the future value or a cash balance you want to attain after the last payment is made. Okay. If FV or future value is omitted, it is assumed to be zero. Okay. Next one is type, which is also optional. And there are two arguments here. 0 and 1. 0 indicates your payments are due at the end of each month or 1 indicates your payments are due at the beginning of each month. Okay. Now one more thing you should consider which is the payment returned by PMT includes principal and interest rate but no taxes, reserve payments or any fees that is associated with the loans. Okay. Make sure you consider this thing. So, hope you understand and let's get straight to the function. So, we're going to do it practically. Let's say we have a loan amount which 10,000. Let's say our annual interest rate is 6%. Total time period of our loan is let's say 2 years. Total number of payments should be 24 months. Now, we are going to find out the payments we are going to pay per month. Okay. So, let's get started write equal to and then write PMT which is our function and first argument is interest rate which is 6% but remember this is annual interest rate so we are going to divide it by 12 okay NPER that means number of payments which is this one 24 because we are going to pay over 2 years then present value is 10,000 future value consider 0 and type we are going to use 0 because our payment is due at the end of the period okay close parenthesis and press enter so this is our monthly mortgage payment and now if we want to consider the total loan cost we are going to use this formula simple so we simply multiply the number of amount paid each month and total number of payments okay so if you want to find the same thing but amounts due at the beginning of each month we are going to change the formula a bit and let's see what is gonna be equal to pmt interest rate by 12 number of payment present value future value which is zero and now type you can see we are going to select one and at the beginning of the period so if our payment is due at the beginning of each month then this will be the result so this is what i wanted to show you thank you thanks for watching see you in the next tutorial